Hey YouTube, I want to show you guys how to use the summer board application. So let's get started. First, what you want to gonna do is go into install. So you're going to install now. After that, you're gonna go into source. Click edit. Add. And you're gonna add these three sources that are on the description. Okay. So after you load them up, you're going to install, and you go all the way down into system, which for me is right there. And you're gonna look for a program called Summerboard, not Summerboard Old, just Summerboard. Pre install that, go to themes and in parentheses, Summerboard, not themes and parentheses, anything else that there is in there. Themes, Summerboard. Oh wait, wrong one. Themes, Summerboard. Now there's gonna be a bunch of packages. All, all of these are themes, a lot of them might not have a background or icons or whatever. But you can just download them and if you don't like them, just uninstall. So, I'm not going to install any for you right now because I already have some that I'm going to show you. So, let's go to there. Just install the ones you want. Okay. You have to go into, once you download Summerboard, it, there's going to be a little black icon like that on your, on your, men, on your, men, on your menu. Sorry. And you're going to go into there. You're going to see a little thing that says Steam. A little, and you're going to see all of these little buttons that you can toggle on or off. So, first let's get started with the theme. Since we're on default on um, Leopard right now, I'm going to show you one that's called Louis Mantia Alt Colors. And it gives you a little preview. And apparently, well, this one changed my icons. See, that's a YouTube icon. Changed my little iTunes icon. Changed a bit of them. Photos. But it didn't come with a wallpaper. That's the problem. So, if you want one with a wallpaper, go back into themes and pick another one. There's one that's called Vista Ultimate. This one's really cool. Similar to the iPod Touch Masters theme, but it's not green. Okay, so this one changes mostly all of your icons. And it's really cool. Except for these two, I don't know why. And, yeah. So, you can do a lot of stuff in SMB preps. Like, skip the last row of your icons. And what this does, it, it gets so you won't have that many crowded icons. It gets rid of your last row and puts it on the second page. See? You can also take the theme wallpaper off. So you can have your main wallpaper in the background. If you don't want any, if you just want the black default wallpaper, take both wallpaper things off. And you'll have black wallpaper. Simple. If you have any questions, email me and thank you.